Hello friends, in this video we are going to see how to interface ultrasonic distance sensor and Arduino in Tinkercad. So log in to your Tinkercad account, go to circuits, click on create new circuit. Then here you have to search for Arduino Uno R3. Then search for ultrasonic distance sensor this one so we are going to use ultrasonic sensor and Arduino Uno R3 for this assignment so now connect echo pin of ultrasonic sensor to pin number 2 and trigger pin to pin number 3. Ground will be connected here like this. ground and VCC VCC will be connected to 5 volt power supply like this okay now these are the connections for connectivity of ultrasonic sensor and Arduino. Now, our next task will be we need to write the code. So click on the code, select text and here we need to write the code for ultrasonic sensor and Arduino. So this is the code that we are going to use for this now what is there in this code first of all echo pin is defined for pin number 2 and trigger pin is defined for pin number 3 then two variables have taken one will be your duration and second one will be your distance so duration variable will be used to calculate the duration required for sound wave to generate and to reach up to the obstacle or object and with the help of that duration the distance will be calculated the distance between obstacle and ultrasonic sensor now next is setup function in that setup function trigger pin is set for output echo pin is set for input and baud rate for communication is set for 9600 this is standard value now second function is your loop function in that loop function first of all keep your trigger pin as low with the help of digital write function then add the delay of 2 in microseconds after that we need to set the trigger pin to high that is it will be in active mode for 10 microseconds so delay is set as 10 microsecond after that the trigger pin will be low so that trigger pin will be in high mode or in high state for 10 microsecond and after that it will be your low with the help of this we need to calculate the duration so duration will be calculated with the help of your pulse in function which will be implemented for echo pin which is an pin number 2 when it will be high so the sound wave travel will be in your microsecond whatever we will get it will be in microsecond so we need to calculate the distance because we are getting the duration in this variable with the help of this function pulse in function so when we will get the duration it will be easy for us to calculate the distance so the formula will be 
डिस्टेंस इज इक्वल टू ड्यूरेशन इन टू जीरो पॉइंट जीरो थ्री फोर डिवाइड बाय टू दिस इज स्टैंडर्ड वैल्यू जीरो पॉइंट जीरो थ्री फोर वी नीड टू मल्टीप्लाय ड्यूरेशन विथ दिस जीरो पॉइंट जीरो थ्री फोर एंड इट इज डिवाइडेड बाय टू बिकॉज साउंड वेव इज डिवाइडेड इन टू टू दैट इज साउंड वेव विल गो एंड इट विल बी बैक so we will get the distance between obstacle and ultrasonic sensor with the help of this formula and at the end we are going to dis uh, display this particular distance between obstacle and sensor in centimeter it will be in centimeter so let's run this code click on start simulation it is started now next task is open serial monitor see click here this is the distance we are getting here in this serial monitor so when you change the distance when you change the obstacle distance will be changed you can see like this so the distance is calculated with the help of your this sound wave is generated and it will be written back from the obstacle with the help of this the distance between this obstacle and this ultrasonic sensor has been displayed it will be calculated with the formula duration sorry distance is equal to duration into 0.034 divided by 2 and we can see the distance between obstacle and ultrasonic sensor that distance will be in centimeters thank you